Say hello to Pepper. Pepper is high tech, low maintenance, and not your typical robot. Pepper's not here to replace humans or even vacuum the floor. Pepper is here to make people happy, help them grow, and enhance their lives. Think of it as high tech. You can high five. Awesome. Pepper can be incredibly helpful interacting with customers and solving problems or providing information. That's because Pepper is a friend, an advisor, and a business partner. In fact, there's only one thing Pepper isn't, a finished product. And that's where you come in. By creating new content and new usages, developers just like you will progressively advance Pepper's growth. And you'll quickly discover that not only do Pepper's SDKs make it easy to jump right in, but this is also unlike anything else you've ever worked on. Because now, your ideas truly do come to life. So, what do you say? Want a challenge? Want to make the world a better place? Want to just hack into something really freaking cool with endless possibilities? Then we want you. Pepper's SDK comes with access to a smart, passionate, vibrant community with tons of development support. So join the movement to enhance and elevate Pepper, the emotional humanoid robot built to benefit mankind. Oh, and remember, it's not just a robot. It's Pepper. This is Pepper today. Where will you take Pepper tomorrow? When I was a kid, after seeing Johnny Number no. 5 Robot from the movie Short Circuit, it has always been my dream to build a robot for every family one day. Therefore, we've been working on how to make a robot that's affordable for everybody. In fact, our first movable tablet robot was finished in 2014. But that wasn't enough for us. We kept on thinking what other possibilities our robot could provide aside from the existing functions. And that's how Robelf, your moving monitor guardian, was born. You can schedule Robelf for home security patrol. Robelf's moving monitoring system can use its indoor positioning function even outside the house to do image analyzing, abnormal notification, and remote monitoring for basic security purposes. So no more worrying when no one's at home. Robelf, I'm back. Do you want to hear Mom and Sweetie's voicemail now? Honey, I'll go buy something. If you're hungry, there's pizza in the fridge. I'll be back later, love you. We also want Robelf to guard the family memories, just like a family guardian. Robelf's interactive entertainment system can take your voice commands. Robelf, what story are we going to tell tonight? You choose. Pinocchio, The Three Little Pigs? Or do you want to hear again Lisa's favorite, The Greedy Elephant? 
Daddy, I want Mommy with us. Robelf has a detachable back camera, the Elfi. It helps Robelf to record family movies. The rack designed for the Elfi allows you to get the best shot angles. You can also use Robelf to preview images from the Elfi. Everyone is connected with zero distance. Seafood paella. Hey, Zembo, help me find a seafood paella recipe. Step one, put the onion and fennel in the bowl and then add some olive oil. Okay, next step. Well, well, well. 65 years young. Mine's still sharp as a tack. I didn't even need a reminder about the photo shoot today. Bob, you have one to-do item. Take blood pressure medication. All right. Of course. Back in my day, we knew how to dress for a photo. I'm always adding to my outfit to help keep it fresh. Thomas! Big guy, how about adding one of those leather belts to Grandpa's outfit? Uh, sure, need help ordering it? Smart as a whip, my boy! Okay, just click on Buy It Now and press on Login with the account I set up for you last time. B-O-B-A-W-E-S-O-M-E -E. Did I ever tell you you're my favorite grandson? Ow! All right, kids. Get over here. Hey, Zembo, let's read The Big Bad Wolf and the Seven Little Sheep. You ready? After the door opened, the postman that... turned out to be the Big Bad Wolf what? instead. <laughs> I'm the Big Bad Wolf. I'm going to eat you! Eat her, not me! Uh, ah! My little sheep, cover your face and don't let the big bad wolf find you. You think I can't find you? I will eat all of you little sheep! Dad, this story is better than your last book. Whoa, whoa, that's harsh. I guess playtime's over. Daddy's got to go work on his craft. Fine. Must be up here somewhere. Whoa. I'm just trying to find my, uh... Hey, what do you know? My scarf! Look what I found. Just stay there. Eric will be over to pick you up. And Sally, I need you to pick out your clothes. Hurry! <gasps> He's here! Hey, Zembo, unlock the door. Come on, everybody, hurry up! Hey, Zembo, follow me. Can we put the lights up, please? Hey, Zembo, can you make the lights brighter? Okay, turning on the light. Are you guys here now? Hey, Zembo, turn off the TV. Okay, turning off the TV. Wait, wait. Hey, Zembo, come over here. Rock and roll. Well, another year, another successful family portrait. 
It's easy to look back and think that it shouldn't have come together, that none of it should have worked out. But somehow, we always pull through in the end. As much as I would like to take credit for everything, I can't. Thanks, Zenbo. This is your house. This is your car. This is your toothbrush. These are your things. But these are the things that matter. And somewhere in between is this guy. Introducing Jibo, the world's first family robot. Say hi, Jibo. Hi, Jibo. <laughs> Jibo helps everyone out throughout their day. He's the world's best cameraman. By intelligently tracking the action around him, he can independently take video and photos so that you can put down your camera and be a part of the scene. Jibo, take the picture. He's a hands-free helper. You can talk to him, and he'll talk to you back, so you don't have to skip a beat. Excuse me, Anne? Yes, Jibo. Melissa, just sent a reminder that she's picking you up in half an hour to go grocery shopping. Thanks, Jibo. He's an entertainer and educator. Through interactive applications, Jibo can teach. Let me in, or else I'll... Ha! And I'll... Ha! And I'll blow your house in! <laughs> hey, where'd you go? There you are. <laughs> He's the closest thing to a real-life teleportation device. He can turn and look at whoever you want with a simple tap of your finger. Check out my turkey dinner, Mom. I wish you wouldn't eat that. Hey! Food. They make turkey pizza? I want turkey pizza. <laughs> and he's a platform, so his skills keep expanding. He'll be able to connect to your home. Welcome home, Eric. Hey, buddy. Can you order some takeout for me? Sure thing. Chinese, as usual? You know me so well. And even be a great wingman. You have a voice message from Ashley. Want to hear it? Absolutely. Hey, call me when you're home. Better make that takeoff for two, Jibo. We've dreamt of it for years, and now he's finally here. And he's not just an aluminum shell, nor is he just a three-axis motor system. He's not even just a connected device. He's one of the family. Jibo, this little bot of mine. I see do la. Big Eye, do you speak English? Yes, a little. 
Hi, I'm Pig. I, the first personal robot of the world. I can fit your unique requirements. Pig Eye, if you see me wave my hand, please turn on the lamp. Pig Eye, if you see Jake still asleep in his room, turn on lights and play music. It's time for your workout. The temperature is below 40 degrees. You will need a jacket. There are two ways to create products. One believes you are ordinary, one of millions. And research of the market need is based on averages. They define everything, including you. You have the phone call from Dad. The other way is to consider you are unique, that your needs should not be based on averages, that there are other possibilities. A stranger approached the front door. A product you can use in your own unique way. A product that can support possibility. Mom wishes to see you such as a family robot. It should be a live product that can adapt to individuality. Not a preset device. A robot with the basic skills, including educable, voice programming, and an open platform that allows you to create unique applications to fit your lifestyle. A black hole is a region of space time exhibiting such strong Fill me out with a flame I will let you 